And the PGA Tournament drawing is uh, not only big names, but big numbers. PGA officials say they're selling out with an estimated 50,000 tickets sold each day. WLKY's Lauren Adams continues our coverage live at Valhalla with a look at the fans. Lauren? Hi, Vicki. As you can see here behind me, all is quiet tonight, but that wasn't the case just a few hours ago. Thousands and thousands of fans flocking here from not only across the country, but other countries eager to see their favorites tee off here at Valhalla. Thousands of fans heading from tee to tee here at Valhalla. Spectators to an event many will only see from a living room television. Good to see the Kentucky people play well. Megan Kinney, a sophomore on UK's golf team, came to see Kentucky's own Kenny Perry. But admittedly, she also got caught up in what fans have dubbed Tiger Watch. Well, obviously, I did follow Tiger in the beginning. I think everybody can say that, though. Mm, looks good. But others, like George Casey from Mechanicsburg, Pennsylvania, didn't take to the links. He took a seat. Casey is here to celebrate his birthday. This is absolutely the best birthday present I've ever had. And planned on enjoying the view from hole number 12. But William Sheehan is moving and following Rory McElroy. After all, he came all the way across the Atlantic Ocean to see Ireland's favorite golfer. He's one of the best golfers of all time. And he, we're so proud of him in, in Ireland. And we're proud, all proud to be Irish. Because we see this young man the way he can swing the club and drive this ball. Sheehan was impressed by Valhalla's lush links. The green is the very same as Ireland. The only thing we're missing here is sheep. But on this very first day of the PGA Championship, it's the golfers that are the biggest attraction. It's just nice to see that all these guys have put so much time, so much effort. They spend so much of their life just devoting themselves to golf. And to see all that hard work pay off, it's very inspiring. And Rick, Vicki, I've got to tell you, walking around here today is quite the experience. You were able to meet dozens and dozens of people. Of course, there are a few language barriers with some. The PGA officials tell me 29 countries are represented here. We're live tonight from Valhalla, Lauren Adams, WLKY News.